If you are struggling to figure out how to update the firmware on your Sony ZV-1 from your Mac, this video should get you moving in the right direction. He's the pretty good photographer. Hello once again folks, Shannon here. I received my brand new Sony ZV-1 camera today and was excited to get started with it. I struggled, however, to get the firmware updated from 1.0 to 2.01 from my Mac running Mac OS 11.2.3. There are a few tricks I learned along the way today and I'm going to share those with you along with links to the software you'll need to get this done. As of this video, if you have an Apple Silicon Mac, you're still out of luck. But if you are on an Intel based Mac and new to Sony cameras, this video will show you how to get this done. Do you remember what it was like as a kid at Christmas time? You woke up excited for that new toy that you asked for and finally the last gift to open, there it was. This is awesome! But then as you're looking at the box, you see those three dreaded words. Batteries not included. Come on, someone saw this and stocked up before the holidays, right? No! Come on! That was pretty similar to what I experienced today trying to get this firmware updated. Here is what you need to know and how you might save some frustration in getting this update. I needed to install three items to get this firmware update. I learned this the hard way. You will need the following. Sony driver loader, Sony camera driver, and Sony firmware update 2.01 for Mac. There are also camera settings that need to be changed prior to this update. You will also need a battery with over three bars of charge. Once all of that was prepared, this firmware update was simple, but it took me a while to get there. Just a quick jump in here to say, if you are getting value out of this video, please consider hitting the like button. I started directly with the firmware update, but when I tried to launch it, I got an error saying I needed the Sony driver loader. What is that? So I googled Sony driver loader found it, downloaded it, installed it. I tried the firmware update again and got another error message. I thought it was the same one. So I reinstalled the driver loader, tried the firmware update, same error. Tried a few more times, the same error. Ah! Then I noticed the error wasn't for driver loader, but for camera driver. You mean I actually have to pay attention to the words on the screen? Googled Sony camera driver for Mac, found it, installed it. I made the camera setting changes and by this time the battery had plenty of time to charge. Maybe that's the whole reason they're doing this. Once it was all connected and all of the other software was installed, this update was a breeze and it works exactly as expected. I'm very happy with the camera and the webcam update. So that's how I was able to get the Sony ZV-1 firmware updated from 1.0 to 2.01. I hope you found this helpful or you were at least mildly entertained by my stupidity. That will do it for today's video. Folks, as always, thank you for watching my videos. And I will talk to you again next time. He's the pretty good photographer.